Hey guys, so we're in the car because obviously we're about to go thrifting. During my no buy, this was the one thing I allowed myself to do, which is thrift because obviously that is what my channel is about. It's sustainable. I love a good thrift trip and that just, it just wasn't something I was willing to give up. But as far as my August no buy is going, I'm just going to say, I, I quit. I quit. <laughs> I quit. <laughs> yeah, it just hasn't been going well at all. And um, that's that on that. So I think I quit. <laughs> I quit. We were just broken, shattered, singing along to nothing matters. Stray around like nighttime rumors. We were in too deep. I am really looking for sweaters because I found myself wanting to buy them off of H&M. H&M has had some really cute like cardigans and sweaters coming up and I did buy like a couple, but I decided I wanted to go try to thrift them. It is hot as hell right now. It is literally over hundred degrees. Please hold. It's literally like a hundred degrees outside. I just, it's so unpleasant. I can't imagine that anybody actually wants to thrift for a sweater right now. So I feel like I should have some pretty good luck. I'm just gonna go to my local thrift store. I don't wanna really drive too far, but this weekend I'm definitely gonna spend some time trying to thrift at all of the thrift stores in this area and just separate them into different videos. So definitely stay tuned for that, subscribe. I'm going to return a package. I ordered these these jeans that I have been wanting for a long time from a Goldie. They were the crisscross jeans and I really, I ordered a size down because everybody was saying they ran big and to order a size down, but I ordered a size down, they definitely would not even button. So I don't think I'm gonna reorder them in a larger size because I just feel like aside from the crisscross on the front they don't really look different than anything else I have and I think people probably said that they ran big because they're not too used to like a vintage fit or a Levi's fit of jeans so that's just my theory on that I felt them and they just they didn't feel any better than the Levi's that I already have in my collection they definitely had the same style the same type of fit and just I just, I didn't feel like they were worth $200. So I am returning them. Hopefully FedEx is open. And then we are going to head over to the thrift store. And um, just, I want to point out my nails. Look at them. I just did a new poly gel set. But I did them at a like normal, this looks like my real nails length. So I'm really loving them. And I used the Nail Attic polish that I love added some jewels I just really 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 love them okay anyways yeah so that's enough of that I'm gonna return this package and then we are gonna head to the thrift store all right that was a bust my package came in a FedEx box but apparently the the label is UPS so um that's a little bit further than I want to drive right now I just want to make it to the thrift store and then maybe if I make it out of there in time I'll stop by UPS or I'll just have to do that tomorrow but we are at the thrift store so let's go this is super cute it's like a light linen dress if it was in my size i would totally get that oh i love this brand let's see we'll have to inspect it We have a very nice linen oversized shirt or what is this almost like a jacket I like these 
mother of pearl type buttons. I think I'm gonna snag that. I actually love tops like this. It reminds me of three people a lot. Um, gotta get that. I will definitely wear that. We just building it's my season, lay foundation, make a name for generations, please and make a and take a This is cute, it's just not my style. Oh, that's really cute too. I would definitely get that if it were my size. I wish this was a little bit more oversized. Um, it's a large, I might be able to fit it, but I don't know. Now this is so dope. That is a definite must buy. Take a break or a little vacation and chase and blues away. You always posting up pictures, trying to look like you're winning, or look like you always be working, soaking the moments you live in. Yeah, you got the nerve to be on me, faking your life for the IG. If you got my number, don't ask me. All right, you guys, um, I have a good amount of stuff here, but I already know some of it I'm not gonna get. So I'll show you some of that and then go over it with you. I feel like I could be having a better trip, but it is so freaking miserably hot in here. It's so unpleasant, y'all, it is so unpleasant. So I'm really, really trying to do this, but that's why I'm not being able to get that much footage. So, oh gosh, I feel like I'm gonna pass out. Nice little vintage piece that has these like puffy shoulders. Nice little blue color, but I don't know, it's a little dingy. I don't know. I'm gonna pass on that for now, but keep looking. I really love this cover in sweaters, but I thrifted a really great one last season, so unless I find one that's absolutely amazing, I won't get another. Look at this beauty. Y'all know I don't need this, but I'm gonna try it on anyway. Looks like it's kind of discolored though, so we'll see. This is such a cool windbreaker, but I'm so mad whoever got it ruined it and cut the sleeves. Oh, that's so disappointing. Oh my gosh, I just noticed something. I actually donated these. I had gotten them from a Goodwill, but this peeling inside made me never want to wear them. So I came here and donated a bunch of shoes. Bags are looking very sparse. This looks like a coach bag. Oh, it is. Actually, false alarm. I just inspected it. It is definitely not. I worry about what the wave only worry about me. If bomber jackets were my thing, this would actually be a really dope one. It doesn't have a brand in it, but there's also one in blue. This one looks brand new though. Well, never mind. Ooh, if that was my size, definitely a musket. Doesn't look like there's really anything new in the sets. This is all the sets, you guys, like literally all that. Such, such a cute set. Double breasted, it's a size 10 though. But man, if you took that skirt and made it a mini, this is so clueless vibes. 
and I like the yellow in it. All right, y'all, I'm going to the men's section to see if they have better sweaters, but um, I think I'm about to be done, and then I'm gonna weed through like the little bit that I have and see what I'm actually gonna take home. Oh my gosh, look at this Dickies situation. If it wasn't for the fact, <laughs> There's no way this would ever fit me, but this is something that they would normally keep around for like Halloween and way overcharged for it. It still has the tags on it. I can't think of anything I could do with this that would make it worth getting it. This is actually really dope. Look at that. Definitely vintage. It's $9.99. I might consider getting this. Things like this, it's actually trending and I really do like this color. I might get this and kind of see what I could do to it to make it interesting. Look at this. This is actually really dope. I am getting this. And they have one of these in brown but it has stains on it. I wonder, can it be saved? Should we try? I think I'm gonna stick with the green one. I don't wanna take chances. Nice little leather trench. Definitely a petite, because the sleeves are short, it's a size four. It even has the belt with it in the pocket. Super cute, but I already have a leather trench, so not gonna try this one on uh maybe maybe we'll see maybe we'll try it on okay so i just want to talk about the things i'm not getting i'm not going to get this because i just know i'm not going to wear it this i found some grease stains on it right there so we're not going to get that i don't need another white button up which you know as cool as that is i have a bunch didn't really like the way this looked on me and this is one of those items that the concept of it is cool, but true to my style, this isn't really it. So I felt like I would have been getting it because I felt like I should, even if I didn't really like it that much. So these are the things I'm passing on. So I actually didn't end up getting anything. I had three things in my hand that I was gonna get, but the guest vest just didn't fit right. The sweater that was like the Argyle with the gold was itchy and I just knew immediately I wouldn't wear it if it was itchy. That trip was a bust. I really just, I wasn't gonna buy things for the sake of just buying it. The Adidas jacket was cool, but like, I thrifted a really bomb one that I still have not worn, so I just didn't wanna add to that. Yeah, I mean, I'm over buying things at the thrift store that I feel like I should buy just cause it's a great find because I'm not a reseller. So it's just gonna sit in my closet. So that's it for this thrift trip. Um, Hopefully I can uh, do better at the next store. We should be this weekend.